the Wichita State University Fairmount College of Liberal Arts and Sciences and College of Fine Arts 119th Spring Commencement Ceremony is now open. Please remain standing for the National Anthem. Say, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hail at the twilight's last gleaming? Whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight o'er the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streamed. You may be seated. Thank you, Troy Fisher, Caleb Faust, Jake Segrist, Matthew Weber, for performing the national anthem. Good morning. I'm Ron Matson, Dean of the Fairmount College of Liberal Arts and Sciences. We are pleased to welcome parents, friends, relatives, students, university administrator, faculty, and staff to this important occasion for graduates. Joining me on the platform today is Dr. Lou Medveen, our Grand Mount Marshal who carried the mace and led the processional, Lou is a professor with the psychology department. Please stand and be recognized. <laughs> Joining me on the platform today are university dignitaries and guests. Please stand and remain standing as you are introduced. Audience, please hold your applause until they have been introduced. Dr. John Bardo. President of Wichita State University. Dr. Tony Bazzini, Provost and Senior Vice President of Wichita State University. Dr. Blake Fran Flanders, Representative from the Kansas Board of Regents. Mr. David Hickman, Commencement Speaker. Ms. Courtney Marshall, President and CEO of the Wichita State University Alumni Association. Dr. Marche Fleming Randall, Assistant to the President for Diversity and Senior Assistant Dean, Fairmount College of Liberal Arts and Sciences. Dr. Werner Goling, Vice President of Administration and Finance, Dr. Terry Hall, Vice President for Student Affairs, Dr. Elizabeth King, President and CEO of the WSU Foundation, Mr. David Moses, General Counsel, Mr. Andrew Schlapp, Executive Director of Government Relations and Board of Trustees, Mr. John Tomlin, Vice President for Research and Technology Transfer and Executive Director of the National Institute of Aviation Research, Dr. Dennis Levesey, Dean of the Graduate School and Associate Vice President of Research and Technology Transfer, Dr. Rodney Miller, Dean of the College of Fine Arts, Dr. Kimberly Engber, Dean of the Dorothy and Bill Cohen Honors College, Dr. Jeremy Patterson, Director of the Institute for Interdisciplinary Creativity, Ms. Kathy Downs, Dean of the University Libraries, Mr. Bill Coleman, our name reader, Dr. Chuck Kober, Senior Associate Dean and Associate Professor, Fairmont College of Liberal Arts and Sciences, Ms. Wendy Haynes, Assistant Dean, College of Fine Arts, please help me thank them for their many contributions. <laughs> well, there's a lot of power there, and I just set them down, didn't I? <laughs> <laughs> 
We are also honored to have Patricia Vizzini, wife of Wichita State University Provost and Senior Vice President Tony Vizzini, Miriam Hickman, the wife, the wife of David Hickman and our honored speaker, and Dr. Walter Myers, College of Fine Arts Dean Emeritus and his wife Kay. With us today, please stand to be recognized. It is now my great pleasure to introduce a very special group. Every great university has a dedicated faculty. These are the professionals who teach in the classroom and the laboratory, work individually with students, provide advice about careers, design academic programs that reflect the landscape of knowledge and generate new knowledge that students will learn in the future. Would all university faculty please stand and be recognized and please join me in acknowledging the faculty of Wichita State University. Thank you. Finally, there are many more who are essential in our village. There are university support staff and unclassified professional staff members who routinely smile at you, help you with your problems, and in the final analysis, keep this grand university operating each and every day. Many of these individuals are not here, but would all university staff please stand and be recognized. Thank you. The John R. Barrier Distinguished Teaching Award is given each year to a full-time faculty member in the humanities or social science divisions of Fairmont College. This peer recognition award acknowledges a professor, first, whose teaching is outstanding, second, who has an impact on the lives and career choices of students, third, who has the ability to enliven teaching and enrich the understanding of students. The Barrier Award is made possible by a gift from Mary Ellen Barrier. This year's winner of the John R. Barrier Award is Dr. Brigitte Roussel. Brigitte, would you join us, please? <laughs> Dr. Roussel is an associate professor of French, a specialist of the French Renaissance. She mostly researches four French women writers for the first half of the 16th century from the point of view of gender studies in a comparative approach highlighted in her articles, book chapters, conference proceedings, encyclopedia entries, and book reviews. Dr. Roussel teaches upper division French courses, including survey and specialized French literature, medieval, renaissance, and 17th century, advanced conversation, civilization, and phonetics. Dr. Russell also coordinates the exchange program between Wichita State University and the University of Orleans, France, where students in both sides, on both sides experience study abroad and obtain transfer credits in their major field. In supporting Dr. Russell's nomination for this award, a student wrote, quote, I'm an international business student who took her 500 level French literature class. It was one of the best classes I have taken and she was a perfect model of how a teacher should interact with their students. I had plenty of one-on-one -on -one time with her to develop my project. She was present, but gave me room to follow my own thoughts, which was helpful in allowing me to grow as a researcher. She was always helpful in answering questions and was a great source of information." End quote. Another student said, quote, her passion for the French language and French literature is endless and is one of her most admirable qualities. I aspire to have the passion she has. Dr. Roussel effortlessly engages her students in lessons with difficult subject matter while, she, while still remaining uh, a lighthearted uh, person created that kind of atmosphere. She is a joy to have for a professor." End quote. Congratulations, Dr. Roussel. Rosalie and Alvin Sarachek Award for Scholarly Excellence in the Natural Sciences is given annually to a graduating senior majoring in biology, chemistry, geology, or physics in the Fairmont College of Liberal Arts and Sciences. Decisions about the award are based on evidence of a candidate's intellectual acuity, scholarly breadth, and achievements in science as an undergraduate. 
Rosalie and Alvin Sarachek Award is presented to Olivia Hull. Olivia, please come forward for your recognition. <laughs> Olivia is a double major in chemistry and mathematics. Her faculty describe her as inquisitive with a high aptitude for science and math. She has a natural drive to work hard. She is always seeking answers in academics and research. She's an exceptional student. She consistently performs at the top of her classes and at the top of the nation in American Chemical Society norm standardized exams. Another of her strong suits is her ability to communicate about science. This fall, Olivia applied for and was awarded the National Institutes of Health funded Kansas IDEA Network of Biomedical Research Excellence Program Undergraduate Research Award. Olivia drafted an eloquent proposal regarding fluorine NMR chemical shifts in small molecules and proteins. Her communication skills also translate into good interpersonal skills. She has a comfortable rapport with her classmates and was an excellent resource as a peer instructor for Chem 1. Olivia's wit, dry sense of humor, and compassion for others makes working with her a joy. WSU's chemistry faculty believe Olivia has the capacity to make significant contributions in chemical research. After working on experimental synthesis of nanoparticles at the research experience for undergraduate program at the University of Southern California in the summer of 2015, Olivia came back ready to work on a more rational approach to synthesizing nanoparticles with desired properties. That led to her seeking another REU research experience in 2016 at the University of North Texas to work on theoretical and modeling aspects of nanoparticles. It is quite rare for an undergraduate to be so focused on what he or she wants to do in research and to have the scientific knowledge to articulate research problems and the methods that should be taken to approach them. Olivia will be attending the doctoral program in chemistry at Kansas State University to carry out theoretical chemistry research with Christine Aiken. May I just add, I'm sorry, I don't know you better. <laughs> Graduates, you are here today to mark the end of one leg of your lifelong journey of learning, that of students here at Wichita State University. While you may no longer be on campus every day, you will always be part of our Shocker family. It is my pleasure to ask Courtney Marshall to welcome you to that community. you did. On behalf of the Wichita State University Alumni Association, it's my pleasure to welcome you here today. Congratulations. I want to take just a moment to say thank you to all the family and friends that helped make this day possible for each of you graduating today. Let's give them a round of applause. The message that I want to deliver to each of you graduating today is simple. You are now a part of an important and unique group of people who represent Wichita State University everywhere. You're now a member of the Shocker alumni family with nearly 100,000 graduates worldwide. As alumni, you also have the power to assist your university in many, many ways. One way is by encouraging others who are seeking to further their education to look to Wichita State University. Remember, you will always be a unique example of the kind of success that Wichita State University makes possible. We truly believe each of you will excel because of the educational foundation you achieved here at Wichita State. As you make significant strides towards professional and personal success, we encourage you to stay connected to your alma mater by becoming a participant in the Alumni Association. 
We're going to help you do that by giving each one of you that are graduating today a one-year gift membership in the Alumni Association. All you have to do is just search and download the Alumni Association app, and then you'll be able to download your membership. And then that way you can keep in touch with us, stay connected, it, and let us know the things that are going on in your life, because we want to know. Being a member of the association helps enrich our worldwide Shocker network. It creates opportunities for engagement and can actually help increase the value of your degree. Finally, please maintain contact with your alma mater and its alumni association. Update your address on the app or our website and let us know of your accomplishments in life so that we can celebrate with you. The impact that you make on the world represents, in part, the success of Wichita State University and the education that you received here. Good luck on your future endeavors. Once again, congratulations on your degree and welcome to Wichita State's Shocker alumni family. Congratulations. I would like to invite Provost and Senior Vice President of Wichita State University, Dr. Tony Vizzini, back to the podium to introduce our next guest. Well, good morning. Nice and bright morning, great weather out there. Glad to have you all here. Thank you, Dr. Matson. It is now my pleasure to introduce the President and CEO of the Kansas Board of Regents. This is the policy board that oversees higher education in Kansas. We are honored to have Dr. Blake Flanders with us today. In his role, he, was, he has been the state leader for issues involving the state's post-secondary education and training system, including targeted expansion of engineering and nursing programs. And Dr. Flanders also has led the state-level evaluation of research proposals within the experimental program to stimulate competitive research. Born in Edison, Kansas, Dr. Flanders is a graduate of Colby Community College and Kansas State University, where he earned a Bachelor of Science in Animal Science, Master's of Science in Animal Science, and Doctorate of Philosophy in Curriculum and Instruction. Please help me welcome Dr. Flanders to Wichita State University. Thank you, Provost Nazini, President Bardo, members of the faculty and staff, and all the shockers that are here to celebrate this special day. I am both delighted and honored to bring you greetings and best wishes from the Kansas Board of Regents. Thank you for allowing me to be with you today. Graduates, what an amazing accomplishment. This day and all the festivities that come with it symbolize the culmination of years of study, hard work, and commitment. The aim of higher education as we uh, at the Board of Regents envision it goes beyond helping graduates like yourselves to succeed professionally. As important as that is for both you as individuals and for our society as a whole. Rather, we know that higher education remains the best way for people to improve the quality of their lives, to raise the standard of living for their families, and to contribute their talents to our communities. No matter your origin, race, social status, or economic background. The contribution of your thinking, your planning, your talents will be the legacy that you leave. And you will now become an alumni of the Kansas Region System, joining over 350,000 other alumni residing here in Kansas, either because they graduated and stayed or returned to make Kansas their home. And I hope that you will consider staying here in Kansas to create the industries of our future, write the next great American novel, or even maybe lead our universities. And I also hope that you will become a strong advocate for our public higher education system. I wish each of you joy, happiness, and fulfillment wherever your chosen path takes you. We are here today to honor your achievements Class of 2017, the Kansas Board of Regents offers our collective congratulations. Thank you, Dr. Flanders, for your congratulatory remarks. 
I now would like to invite the Dean of the College of Fine Arts, Dr. Rodney Miller, to the podium, and he will introduce our next guest. I always bring my fan club. <laughs> I am very pleased to introduce Regents Professor David Hickman. David is one of the world's leading classical trumpet soloists and teachers, having released 19 solo albums. He has been a guest soloist with over 2,000 orchestras and is the founder and president of the large American ensemble Summit Brass. He is one of the founders of the International Trumpet Guild and served as its president from 1977 to 79. His 45 years of university teaching have produced hundreds of leading professionals who occupy chairs in major symphony orchestras, military bands, and chamber ensembles as well as professorships at over 150 colleges and universities. Hickman's publications in include books such as Trumpet Pedagogy, a Compendium of Modern Teaching Techniques and Trumpet Greats, a Biographical Dictionary, Music Speed Reading, The Piccolo Trumpet, and many others. He is also of the publisher of editions of over 150 trumpet solos. A native of Kimball, Nebraska, Hickman received his Bachelor of Music degree from the University of Colorado Boulder in 1972, and then became a graduate teaching assistant under Dr. Walter Myers at Wichita State University, earning a Master of Music degree in 1974. He taught at the University of Illinois from 1974 to 1982 before accepting a position at Arizona State University. ASU conferred upon him the title of Regents Professor of Music in 1989, a position he still holds. We are honored to have him with us today. Please join me in welcoming David Hickman. Thank you. I am pleased and honored to be here at my alma mater, Wichita State University, and I wish to thank President Bardo, Provost Vizzini, Dean Miller, Regents Flanders, and Dean Matson for inviting me to be your speaker today. I am also pleased that my wife, Dr. Miriam Hickman, is with me for this special occasion. Most of all, I'm, I want to congratulate you the graduates of 2017 for a job well done. As College of Fine Arts and Liberal Arts majors, you are what faculty used to refer to as dreamers. Dreamers because you chose a less practical degree option than your colleagues who majored in law, medicine, computer science, or engineering. Your career paths may be less logical than others, but your passion and thirst for knowledge and the sharing of this knowledge with others will ultimately define you in a unique way. Each of you will have a different skill set, different route to success, and an individual means of expressing who you are and what you are to become. Your careers will be formed by your own interests and personal spins on the areas of, of expertise you have chosen. And, and this will give you greater personal satisfaction than your more logical colleagues. It is often said that you don't find a profession, it finds you. My own personal experiences certainly bear this out. Although I hate to admit it, I was a troubled youth. I grew up in a small oil farm town in Nebraska, about, population about 3,000. And like all kids, I wanted to be noticed and appreciated, but I was not particularly smart, 
not uh, very popular, and had no great talent for sports. It seemed that the only way I could get attention was by cutting up in class, taking dares, and getting in trouble. By the time I was in fifth grade, I was sent to the principal's office on a weekly basis. Whether I was blamed for everything, whether I did it or not. <laughs> and I even had a few run-ins with the law. Things were starting to get serious. In sixth grade, we had the opportunity to sign up for band. I had absolutely no interest in this, but my best friend at the time told me that his parents wanted him to join the band because there was a musty old trumpet in the attic that his grandfather wanted to give to him. So I, just, I asked him why I should join the band, and he said, well, we can sit together and have fun goofing off, and that chicks dig trumpet players. <laughs> And I knew that the famous trumpeter Harry James married the, the beautiful movie actress Betty Grable, so I wondered if maybe there wasn't something to that. <laughs> what I found out later, though, is that chicks don't dig all trumpet players. <laughs> I asked my parents if they would buy me a trumpet, and I was surprised that they were happy to do so. I think they were willing to do anything to keep me off the streets. But because I seemed to destroy most everything I owned, they opted to buy a third-hand instrument for, for a few bucks. Well, it turned out that my friend practiced a lot, and I didn't practice at all. So he sat first chair in the trumpet section, and I sat last, so we were clear across the room from each other. And after about a month, I was thinking about quitting the band, um, but after a band practice one day, our director, a wonderful man named Harry McNeese, approached various students to ask if they were interested in taking private lessons after school. When he asked me, my first reaction was, am I that bad? Then he explained what private lessons were about. So I asked my parents if they would be willing to pay the one dollar for a weekly 30-minute private lesson. Naturally, they jumped at the opportunity. I could not believe that any teacher had any special interest in me the only attention I had received from them before was when I was in trouble. My band director treated everyone with kindness and respect. It didn't take long for me to want to please him, so I practiced several hours each day. Soon I was the best player in the band, and he featured me in a little elementary solo with piano accompaniment during our spring band concert. That day changed my life. I vividly remember parents coming backstage after the concert and telling me that I was going to be the next Al Hurt, a famous trumpeter heard constantly on the radio and television during the early 1960s. This was a huge compliment, and it was also the first time that parents of my friends were nice to me. They usually kicked me out of their homes for not playing well with their kids, were ca calling the police because I kicked down their picket fence with my new cowboy boots, or because I threw a rock through their tool shed window. Driving home after the band concert, I sat in the back seat with my two sisters. I was the middle child, by the way. No one was talking. It was totally quiet. Then, without any forethought, I said what was maybe the most pro profound thing I had said up to that point. Wow, all that attention, and I didn't even get in trouble. <laughs> At that moment, I decided to become a professional trumpet player, and nothing was going to stop me. Of course, I was the only kid in my class who knew of my ambition. But one day, our regular sixth grade teacher asked the class what we wanted to do when we grew up. She started in the front row. Sally, what do you want to do? I want to become an astronaut. Very good, said the teacher. Billy, what do you want to be? I want to be president of the United States. Excellent. Mary, what about you? I want to be a famous movie star. Very good, wonderful. And then she came to me, David, what do you want to be? I want to be a professional trumpet player. Right then, the whole class broke up in pandemonious laughter. I had a reputation of being the class clown, and no one thought I could be good at anything. Yet no one snickered when my, the other kids told of their near impossible careers. This made me all the more determined to work hard and prove them wrong. My band teacher's office wall had a framed motto that read, T 
teach a kid to blow a horn and he'll never blow a safe. <laughs> this was certainly true for me. I began channeling all of my energy into music and gradually began to earn attention in a positive way. Every kid needs an outlet for attention and expression, and I was lucky to find mine so early. Had it not been for a man named Harry McNeese, a teacher with an infectious passion for music and education, my profession might have been making license plates at the state penitentiary. I've had what I consider to be a fun and exciting and rewarding career. Because I do what I love, it never seems like real work. I have shaped my career to pursue what I feel is important, which is key to personal job satisfaction. If you merely follow a path that you think will please others, you might become successful, but will you really find true career happiness? I doubt it. So go ahead and dream a lot. Envision what you feel would be the perfect career for you and how you want it to shape into something worthwhile for others. Dream every day until your vision is as vivid as a movie. Make it clear in your mind so that you cannot imagine any other scenario. In time, and with hard work, you will make it happen. Don't give up. Be open to new opportunities that can help shape your career, and learn to recognize these opportunities, and don't be afraid to take chances or make mistakes. Aim your arrow high. Remember, it's better to aim high and miss than to aim low and hit. Thank you. Thank you, David, for those words of inspiration. At this time, I would like to present the annual College of Fine Arts Faculty Awards. Would the recipients stand as I call your names? Audience, please hold your applause until all award recipients have been recognized. Our first three awards are from the Pete and Mickey Armstrong Excellence Awards. Excellence in Teaching Award recipient is Michael Hanawalt. Michael is an assistant professor in the School of Music and is the director of choral activities. Excellence in Teaching Award recipient is Amy Baker Schriedel. Amy is an associate professor for the School of Performing Arts and the program director for musical theater. Excellence in Creative and Scholarly Activity recipient is Alan Hell. Alan is an associate professor in the School of Music and is the Ann and Dennis Ross Faculty of Distinction in Opera. And his professional career has taken him to virtually every major opera house in the world. The Dorothy Johansson Halk Faculty Fellow recipient is Denise Celestin. Denise is a professor in the School of Performing Arts and is the senior faculty member in the dance program. The Ellen O. Burmeister fac a Piano Faculty Fellow Award recipient is Dr. Julie Bees. Julie is a professor for the School of Music. She could not be here today because she's in Kuala Lumpur performing. Please join me in congratulating these 2017 College of Fine Arts Award recipients. Of the over 604 candidates receiving undergraduate degrees this spring, almost 224 qualified for honors based on their work completed by the end of fall 2016. Would members of the Dorothy and Bill Cohen Honors College and students graduating summa cum laude, magna cum laude, and cum laude please stand and be recognized.
That's a pretty big proportion of the 224, isn't it? You may be seated. <laughs> there is another group of our students I wish to recognize. With those wearing the red, white, and blue cord representing our nation's flag, please stand. These women and men are either serving currently or have served in the military, and we are honored to have them as alumni of our university. Thank you for your service to our country. Will all of you who are current service members or veterans please stand? Ladies and gentlemen, through your service and the sacrifice of many of your brothers and sisters, this nation stands great. You protect and preserve our freedom, and in so doing, ensure the foundation of our educational process. On behalf of a grateful university, I salute you and I thank you. Now, it says in the script, again, you may be seated, but I <laughs> We have now come to the conferring of the degrees and graduate recognitions. <laughs> Dr. Dennis Levesey will present the candidates for graduate degrees. I will present the College of Fine Arts candidates for undergraduate degrees, and Dr. Ron Matson will present the Fairmount College of Liberal Arts and Sciences candidates for undergraduate degrees, and to President John Bardo, who will confer the degrees. After the degree is conferred, candidates will come to the stage to be recognized individually. As graduates cross the stage, they will be awarded with a scroll and a Wichita State University challenge coin from their college. Graduates, you have earned the right to carry the coin of your university. Do so as a constant reminder of your belonging to your alma mater, along with the other alumni, faculty, and staff. President Bardo and Dean Livesey, Please come forward and present the doctoral candidates. Will the candidates for the Doctor of Philosophy please stand? Mr. President, as Dean of the Graduate School, I present these candidates who have completed the requirements prescribed for the respective doctoral degree. They have been recommended by the faculty and are presented for the conferral of these degrees. Thank you, Dean Levesey. Upon the recommendation of the faculty, and by virtue of the authority vested in me by the Kansas Board of Regents, I confer upon you the appropriate degree with all its rights, privileges, and responsibilities thereto appertaining. Welcome to the Guild of Scholars. Please be seated. Will the candidates for the master's degrees please stand? <laughs> Mr. President, these candidates have completed the requirements subscribed for the Master of Arts, Master of Science, Master of Fine Arts, Master of Music, Master of Music Education, Master of Social Work, and Master of Public Administration. 
They have been recommended by the faculty and are presented for the conferral of these degrees. Thank you, Dean Levesey. Upon recommendation of the faculty, and by virtue of the authority vested in me by the Kansas Board of Regents, I confer upon you the appropriate degree with all of the rights, privileges, and responsibilities thereto appertaining. Will the candidates for the bachelor's degrees from the College of Fine Arts please stand? <laughs> they have been recommended by the faculty and are presented for the conferral of these degrees. Upon recommendation of the faculty and by virtue of the authority vested in me by the Kansas Board of Regents, I confer upon you the appropriate degree with all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities thereto appertaining. You may be seated. Will the candidates for the bachelor and associate degrees from the Fairmont College of Liberal Arts and Sciences please stand. These students have been recommended by the faculty and are presented for the conferral of these degrees. Upon recommendation of the faculty and by virtue of the authority vested in me by the Kansas Board of Regents, I confer upon you the appropriate degree with all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities thereto appertaining. Please be seated. We will now recognize indiv candidates individually as they come to the stage. Will the Doctor of Philosophy candidates please come forward with your dissertation advisor to be hooded? Colm Patrick Mitchell. He is being hooded by his dissertation advisor, Dr. Thomas DeLillo. His dissertation is entitled, A Capillary Surface with No Radial Limits. Saud Abdullah Al Ghamdi. He is being hooded by his dissertation advisor, Dr. Kenneth Miller. His dissertation is entitled Composite Optimal Control for Interconnected Singularly Perturbed Systems. Will the candidates for their master's degrees please come to the stage? Suchaporn Mahajurinko. <laughs> Jennifer Kathleen Mackey. <laughs> Jacob Scott Asbridge. 
Melissa Lynn Treadway. Amanda Lang. Cassandra Rose Moore. Andrew Thomas McClellan. Allison Brooke Ferris. Tamara Lynn Martin. Shayna Crisp. Rachel Whitmore. Taylor Nicole Arribalo. Branda Nicole Horsch. Mary Catherine Feeson. Jamie Leanne Reinhardt. Caitlin Neuschaffer. Kirsten May Gupilan. Rachel Sabin Cox. Emily Ann Baker. Kaylin Ray Cheney. Brian A. Robinson. Lori Lynn Barnes. Kelly Arlene Guzman. Timothy James Oglesby. Helen Francis Smalley. Amber Cole DiNapoli. Janessa Ray Crittenden. Robin A. Marin. Amanda Catherine Van. Rachel Jaquetta Weary. Caitlin Michelle Heaton. Percy Carlton Turner. Alyssa A. Quintana. Mackenzie S. Nelson. Carrie Lynn Landrian. Raquel Yvonne Hendricks. Kiera Simone Reed. Tiana Keisha Charles. Janelle Dion Jeffrey. Allison Marie Howerton. Maribel Reyes Rodriguez. Haley Ann Cook. Sarah Kate Ennis. Kimberly Ann Givens. Caitlin Marie Mock. Dawn and Jeanette Howland. Allison Catherine Deiter. Lisa Marie Mensch. Wendy Sue Nicholson. Shannon D. Geiger. Peggy Ann Bennett. Takendra Latrice Stewart. Aaron Michael Moses. Alicia Monique Plummer. Brooke Renee Morris. Maggie Ann Cattell. 
Jennifer J. Wright Allen. Lauren Ashley Conradi. Gamaj Delini Nuantika Pereira. Lipileka Mukariji. Prajwal Bandari. Jonathan Wilkes. Emma Joyce Crabtree. Brittany Elise Brest. Travis Merlin Wiley. Paul Eugene Genlink. Garrett Leon Dinkle. Jones Quacko. Megan Chantel Beeler. Halima Mushalia. Megan Danielle Curtis. Shuyao Lee. Madia Masood. Tyler Wayne Pennick. Kayla Christine Basham. Sierra Elaine Doctor. Kelsey Emily Gardapi. Marcella Diana Jimenez Clau. Shelby Renee Bowman. Elnaz Parviz. Valencia Lachea Scott. Artemius Joseph May. William Joseph Shellstead. Kirsten Renee Crager. Anastasia N. Diamond. Baimi Sola Maureen Ekundayo. Eric Daniel Young. Kelly Marie Brown. Maya Brianna Harper. Sarah Elizabeth Muzzy. Jerry Lynn Yates. Wendell E. Nicholson, Jr. Jonathan Coffey. Abigail Rich. Catherine Marie Fernandez. Jordan Ashley Adams. Linda Dora Presson. Song Yao Liu. Catherine Lynn Herr. Esmeralda Grajeda. Georgina Hernandez Vasquez. Lorenza Carmen Snyder. Allison Ann Griffin. Elizabeth K. Biles. And Jeanette Marie Webster. Jessica Marie Morton. Barry Tyler Smith. John Hunter Tingley. Lance Alexander Onstott. 
Colin Dwyer Duffy. Van E. Williams. Crystal Jean Isaminger. Rhiannon Christine Scharnhorst. Benjamin Christian Hojum. Abraham Stephen Fitzpatrick. Ashton Elise Fanastiel. Brittany Ann Waldman. Lydia Dominguez Ibarra. Kyle Michael Palmer. Clayton Thomas Souter. Christy Lyann Royal. Brittany Shakima Martin. Seth Allen Tiger. Laura Gillen Mattis. Amanda Nicole Allen. Igye Chie Lin. Francesca Monique Chavira. Will the College of Fine Arts Master's candidates please come to the stage to be individually recognized? Amanda Sue Jimson. Ashton Beth Anderson. Andrew Michael Hernandez III. Georgian Yaling. Renee Elizabeth McDonald. Jason Eric Markle. Morgan Alexander Bothwell. Anne Elizabeth Briggs. Elizabeth Carter Thal. Mitchell Dwayne Bowen. Kelsey Lee Wise. Kiera Thalia Cologne. Audrey Nicole Thomas. Sean Ryan Hep Hempner. Michael Joseph Ingdahl. Robert Shane Avila. Caleb Baker Millett. Seth A. Carithers. Benjamin Matthew Riley. Stephen J. White. We will now recognize undergraduate students from the College of Fine Arts. 
Would the graduates receiving the bachelor degrees please come to the stage to be individually recognized? Melinda Ashton Sudbrink. Freddie William Travis III. Graduating magna cum laude, Taylor Marie Swanson. Joanna Christine Herman. Eric Emo Incana. Sarah Nicole Wintgen. Tyler Stone Street. Graduating cum laude, Christopher Ryan Mackey. Grace Diana Kerban. Graduating magna cum laude, Shayla Dawn Ake. Joshua Devin Casey. Marcus Graef. Graduating cum laude, Sarah Christine Roberts. Cum laude, Crystal Lynn Frost. Yvonne Diaz Sustaya. Magna cum laude, Colin Henry Entz. Magna cum laude, Jillian Elizabeth Clough. Gabriela Nicole Garlow. Luis Alberto Adame. Graduating summa cum laude, Kelsey Nicole Proct. Magna cum laude, Hung Ka Lee. Magna cum laude, Christina McCowan. Kimberly Nicole Garrett. Tanya R. Weiss. V. Wynn. Jennifer Metzger. Cum laude, Nicole Daniela Varner. Graduating magna cum laude, Christian Michael Burgess. Magna cum laude, Scott Anthony Hatfield. Magna cum laude, Claire Ann Woody. Summa cum laude, Hannah Elizabeth Gable. Summa cum laude, Bridget Ann Carroll. Summa cum laude, Garrett Donald Veets. Magna cum laude, Christina Joanne Shetler. Magna cum laude, Leah Maureen Heathcote. Yeah! Cum laude, Darren Lynn Brock. Magna cum laude, Anastasia Meredith McPeak. Magna cum laude, Dima Istanbuli. Magna cum laude, Madeline May White. Kristen Nicole Bach. Magna cum laude, Noah Christian Montgomery. Magna cum laude, Hannah Louise Fernandez. Magna cum laude, Kashana Cook. Magna cum laude, Demarius Lemary Ford. Cum laude, DeAndre Latell Teagle. Magna cum laude, Taylor Alexis Phipps. Magna cum laude, Erica Morgan Black. 
magna cum laude, Michaela Deanne Williams. Magna cum laude, Kara Elizabeth Wedeking. Cum laude, Michaela Gabrielle Evans. Haley Anna Rebordi. Brandy Ladale Bailey. Graduating cum laude, Cody Michael Butenbach. James Halcombe Lanning, Jr. Before the bachelor and associate candidates from the Fairmont College of Liberal Arts and Sciences come to the stage, we want to take a moment in recognition of two graduates who are being honored today with a posthumous degree. Our first graduate is Rowena Irani. We ask that Rowena's fellow classmates please stand. Thank you. Please stand. While Rushad Irani, Rowena's brother, comes to the stage to receive this degree in her honor. Our second graduate is Becky Fulcher. We ask that Becky's fellow classmates please remain standing while John and Amy Fulcher come to the stage to receive this degree in her honor. In addition to the posthumous degree, the family is being presented with a stole from the Kappa Kappa Gamma sorority where Becky was a member. recognize the bachelor and associate degrees from the Fairmont College of Liberal Arts and Sciences graduates. Please come to the stage. Kingari Kelvin Kinaro, Amanda Dawn Bell, Cum Laude Emily Suzanne Stewart, Betty Ann Miller, Elisa Marie Berriman, Magna Cum Laude Matthew Cates Mizak, Cum Laude 
Margaret Lou Meister, Andrew Abukalam, Tina Nu Trong, Cum Laude Benjamin David Bauer, Magna Cum Laude Adam Lynn Schultz, Devon Michael Miller, Cum Laude Michaela Aller, Macy J. Harsh, Magna Cum Laude Cole Robert Lopez. Magna Cum Laude, Liu Yang Kalin. Cum Laude, Greg Ryan Geetson. Cum Laude, Bailey Michelle Bonner. Cash Clenard. Magna Cum Laude, Allison Kayleen Schmidt. Magna Cum Laude, Laura Kathleen Evans. Denver Braden Dodge. Magna Cum Laude, Braden Arthur Leffler. Cum Laude, Kai Min Win. Paul Daniel Grunden. Alexandra Marie Boyd. Magna Cum Laude, James Ethan Franks. Brian Christopher Thompson. Haley Marie Rogers. Cum Laude, Christopher Ross Powell. Cum Laude, Brittany Nicole Harrison. Emma Lane Tharp. Kyle A. Richardson. Todd Michael Kefover. Magna Cum Laude, John George Willemy III. Cum Laude, Mackenzie Faith Meinhart. Jackie Elizabeth Blackwell. Graduating Magna Cum Laude, Natalie Louise Hogue. Alexandria Jean Melton. Ashlyn Victoria Joy. Nikki Lee Hayes. Cum Laude, Caitlin Josephine Irene Miller. Ashley Nicole Weta. Catherine Suzanne Vandenberg. Crystal Weaver. Bradley Tan Ja Wei. Summa Cum Laude, John Austin William Griffith. Zachary Austin Ellis. Graduating Cum Laude, Ian Patrick Edwards. Lorena, Lorena Lachelle McClish. Christine K. Wise Alexander. Ms. Denise Winfield. Natasha Rose Voth. Jenna Lee Kistler. Jeriel Faith Adair. Mecca Nikoi Williams. Giannis Nicole Schnell. Mudfer Ali Albakal. Joseph Lee Stroud II. Graduating Cum Laude, Casey N. Cochran. Cum Laude, Megan Kathleen Madsen. 
Magna cum laude, April Ann Landwehr. Kathy Inez Watson. Ryan Nicholas Shellhammer. Magna cum laude, Rachel Grace Shellhammer. Faith C. Hannah. Bradley Dale Hoffman. Nicole L. Calkins. Graduating cum laude, Logan Michael Gissick. Magna cum laude, Keegan Tanner Clark. Magna cum laude, Sierra Ann Mold. Alyssa Myers. Morgan Elizabeth Kruger. Sydney Reed Maben. Magna cum laude, Robin Nicole Doster. Lee Christine Brown. Nicholas Andrew May. Irma L. Jones Young. Graduating summa cum laude, Amr Fadel Al Sudi. Summa cum laude, Hassan Farhud. Brett Andrew Mundinger. Graduating cum laude, Dominique Mikhail Carey. Graduating cum laude, Andrew John Munns. Garrett Stephen Swilly. Graduating cum laude, William Andrew Lowe. Michael Stanley Boyer. Jonathan Albert Staub. Graduating magna cum laude, Alexander C. Bessel. Callum Albert May. Ethan A. Grennan. Graduating cum laude, Kelly Renee Bartnick. Erica Jane Bowl. Alexandra Danessi Andino. Graduating magna cum laude, Jeffrey Thomas Quinn. Magna cum laude, Casey Charles Worley. Summa cum laude, John Thomas Stoller. Cassandra Carrington. Robert James Camp. Amber Dawn Soliman. Arthur Gustav Johnson V. Graduating magna cum laude, Jacob Andrew Beebe. Susan Yvonne Viertaler. Aline Nicole Anderson. Cum laude, Israel Jordan Taylor. Colton Dean Burblinger. Minika Doreen Rose. Alexandra Jade Bond. Devin Anthony Shivers. Graduating magna cum laude, Jody Ann Betson. Magna cum laude, Alexandria Renee Feldkamp. Cum laude, Michelle Renee Edwards. Brittany Sherelle Pons. Magna cum laude, Carolyn Marie Fugit. 
Jacqueline Marie Conkling. Cum laude, Annette Robertson. Hannah Monique Juer. Magna Cum laude, Shalina Hilger. Nadia F. Hembry. Jemima Rose McPeak. She graduated magna cum laude. Samantha Natalie Stremsky. Terrell Bartow. Hannah Lynn Mortimer. Stefan Ballard Reich. Esther Morris Vasquez. Trapper L. Terrell. Graduating magna cum laude, Julie Liu. Magna cum laude, Abigail June Kretschmar. Magna cum laude, Tao Feng Win. Cum laude, Gabriel William Clark. Drake Miles Watson. Callie Aaron Kimball. Graduating cum laude, Haley Rose O'Rand. Jamie Lynn Woolsey Snyder, Woolley Snyder. Lakila Dominique Williams. Graduating magna cum laude, Anthony Michael Williams. Graduating magna cum laude, Christian Glenn Johnson Eck. Magna cum laude, Justin Levi Woody. Paige Rochelle Baker. Summa cum laude, Matthew William Albers. Benjamin Brandon Harville. Rochelle Lynette Tronson. Ashley Nicole Shirley. Graduating cum laude, Kelsey Lynn Abendroth. Cum laude, Zachary Aaron Parker. Sheridan Leanne Mays. Magna cum laude, Melinda Baruth. Stephanie Leverens. Horatio Gonzalez. Daniel R. Babcock. John Anthony Wernert. Graduating cum laude, Cynthia R. Rexrote. Angelica Renee Clark. Angela Renee Holmes. Magna cum laude, Taylor Danae Harker. Eugene Richard Crane. Jennifer Raybuck. Christopher Kane Squires. Stephen Zach Perry. Jalisa Lavon Chapel. Ellen Marie Zirkel. Carrie Ann Bright. Siandra Nicole Obot. Magna Cum Laude, Michelle Danielle McDowell. Magna Cum Laude, Elena Isabella Soto. 
Marco A. Tapia. Austin L. Drinnen. Taylor Holton. Macy Isabella Amsden. Magna Cum Laude, Ahmad Ali Yassine. Andrew James Sousa. Cum Laude, Emily Michelle Meader. Magna Cum Laude, Rachel Naomi Owens. Tabitha Leanne Peterson. Magna Cum Laude, Heather L. Amaya. Cum Laude, Amanda Delgado. Catherine Ann Weiss. Cum Laude, Matthew Joseph Thomason. Cum Laude, Joshua S. Bond. Mary Carol Ward. Cum Laude, Valerie Nosing. Graduating Magna Cum Laude, Richard Joe Wrangle III. Jennifer Lynn Brady. Ariel Fearson. Magna Cum Laude, Miranda Marie Shirky. Magna Cum Laude, Cassandra Dawn Allen. Heather Yvonne Brown. Jackie Diane Obaidat. Cum Laude, Vera Lee Gant. Christine Michelle Wagner. Aaron C. Fletcher. Cum Laude, Lena Alexandra Lorenz. Magna Cum Laude, Hilary Monisa McCann. Cum Laude, Sharon Ann Troutman. Marina It Duong Pajam. Olivia M. Balderas. Cum Laude, Monica Ortega. Erica Danielle Peter. Magna Cum Laude, Ashley Nicole Martinez. Kayla Marie Bannock. Rachel Marie Howard. Nicole Renee Anderson. Ashley Lynn Watson. Magna Cum Laude, Jennifer Brooke Royston. Cum Laude, Amy Kathleen Stewart. Magna Cum Laude, Sasha Nicole Lockabee. Cum Laude, Derek Ryan Gonzalez. Braley Michelle White. Cum Laude, Jocelyn Corrine Jensen. Genevieve Ellen Clark. Magna Cum Laude, Rachel Stewart. Magna Cum Laude, Tandy LaShawn Clark. Laura Lee Littlefield. Cum Laude, Brandon Lee Johnson. Magna Cum Laude, Terry Yang. Samuel Elliot Womack. Magna Cum Laude, Bray Marie Biggie. Magna Cum Laude, Kit Ives Limpiado. Magna Cum Laude, Jasmine Mayorga. 
summa cum laude Elvin Valerio Salerno. James Alfred Hale. Christina May Dickens. Melissa Marie Smith. Margaret Eileen Rich. Cum laude Andrew Joseph Scanlon. J. Blake Williams. Julie Ann Weiser Freeman. Magna cum laude Molly Aurora Marshall. Cum laude Elizabeth Marie Reinhardt. Tanya K. Stofferen. Emily Sikelli. Graduating cum laude, Brittany Nicole Haskett. Magna cum laude, Erica Anissa Rinke. Graduating cum laude, Jabrea Danielle Strickland. Summa, summa cum laude, Caitlin Joe Patterson. Brandon Scott Schivelbein. Sergio Rene Ziad. Brenna Rene Martinez. Sherilyn Michelle Ham. Cum laude, Bertha A. De Los Santos. Kristen Rene Kelly. Amanda Grace Perkins. Emily Marie Person. Candace Augusta Unruh. Misha Zahir Nazir. Joseph T. Schuneman. Alexandria J. Ann Herzett. William Gerald O'Neill. Summa cum laude, Olivia Ann Hull. Cum laude, Austin Michael Setter. Mark Charles Barris. Graduating summa cum laude, Caitlin Ann Liu. Magna cum laude, Sarah Schindaller. Summa cum laude, Madison Catherine White. Trevor Trent Ruchel. Joel Matthew Trembley. Graduating cum laude, Brianna Grace George. Cum laude, Julie Tu. Timothy Stephen Rocket. Bria Cherie Boykins. Denise Lynn Persinger. Chelsea Elizabeth Martinez. Kurt Benjamin Olson. Graduating magna cum laude, Timothy James Hendricks. Melanie Sean Smith. Magna cum laude, Kirsten Marie Perez. Cum laude, Delon Wynn. Linda Tao Mai. Graduating cum laude, Nibrush Zanat Karim. Samantha Lynn Tran. 
Graduating magna cum laude, Mai Ka Tang. Graduating cum laude, Camden David Tang. Alexander Tai Kao. Justin Zong Zuan Jin Win. Tony Tran. Danny Lee. Graduating magna cum laude, Victor Adam Muniz. Paul Raymond. Haley Nicole Hutchison. Hannah Marie Johnson. Aaron Elizabeth Cole. Alexis Renee Terrell. Chloe Elizabeth Halfley. Victor L. Fitz. Graduating cum laude, Nicholas Richard O'Donnell. Magna cum laude, John Stanley Freeman. Magna cum laude, Madison Renee Downs. Cum laude, Krista M. Pryor. Cum laude, Madison Faye Van Berkleo. Magna cum laude, Janae Capri George. Kadisha Michelle Harris. Vanessa Nicole Riles. Eva Cecilia Nolasco. Graduating magna cum laude, Emily Adelaide Mullins. Magna cum laude, Shelby Lynn Williams. Cum laude, Amanda Nicole Klein. Magna cum laude, Hannah Marie Bothner. Crystal Sierra Bradley. Larissa Lowry, she's graduating magna cum laude. Camilla Isabella Sacco. Michaela Zoe Dieters. Maxwell Runyon. Graduating cum laude, Jessica Ray Ann Green. Manon Bryn Marcott. Cum laude, David Jerome Purcell. Mika Nicole Heyer. Cum laude, Donald Raymond Gehring Jr. Aureli Navarrete Velasquez. Graduating cum laude. Graduating cum laude, Alexander Bryce Kendall Stone. Cum laude, Angela Gail Smith. Magna cum laude, Stephanie Diane Merritt. Lauren Elizabeth McGuire. Cum laude, Allie Olivia Dawn Bontrager. Addison. Madison Brooke Weingartner. Memma Salim. Adriana Somerville. Dalton J. Nelson. Magna cum laude, Charlie Ellen Cleaver. Graduating magna cum laude, Bronwyn Jane Jenkins. Colton Lewis. Cum laude, 
Evan Joseph Thomas Flugrat. T.J. Rigg. Luke. Lucas Anthony May. Harley Sue Shockey. Graduating cum laude, Christine Marie Fuston. J.C. Jean Goodwin. Cum laude, Sarah Wiesner. Byron J. Love. Helen Cruz. Emily Jean Hoover. Steve Penyagua. Graduating magna cum laude, Ruben Lebron. Cum laude, Chanel Wynn. Liberal Arts and Science graduates, you may now move your tassels to the left. This concludes conferring of degrees and the recognition of the candidates. Will the banner bearers please come to the stage and take your positions? At this time, I would like to invite the president of Wichita State University, Dr. John Bardo, back to the podium for a few closing remarks. What a great day. <clears throat> Let's give our graduates one more round of applause. <clears throat> I know it's early in the morning, but y'all can do better than that. Well, before we conclude our ceremony, we have one more very important group of individuals to recognize. Their belief in the success of the graduates seated here before us sustains one of the great American dreams, belief in the importance of education and to enhance life for individuals and affect great positive change in the world. Here with us today are those who have dreamed that dream with our graduates and spent time with them, given encouragement, and provided the support needed to accomplish the seminal life-changing goal of a university degree. Would all parents, spouses, partners, children, friends, and extended families of our graduates please stand to be recognized? Come on, graduates, you can give them a real round of applause. The truth in life is nobody does this alone. Thanks to all of you. Please do remain standing. I'd now like to introduce Troy, Caleb, Jake, and Matt, who will sing the alma mater and the fight song. Please remain standing.
Vigita, Pura Rara for Vigita, March onward, banners high, with courage for second never die. The 119th Spring Commencement Ceremony is now concluded. Please stay standing for the recessional.